There is murder at hand in Geneva. Well now, what's this? Not a bailiff, I hope, or a poet. Meet Percy Shelley, my fellow reprobate in exile. Ah, he's risen. Oh. Joe Buchanan. Sir. An American scientist. Mm. And are those slippers American too? I've quizzed them already, Percy. They were made by Mr. Florsham in a redundancy called New York, New York. <laughs> well, what brings you all the way to our little paradise, Doctor? Just another more. Drawn to Mary's grave. Oh. Mm. Uh, listen, I'm here because of the imminent execution of Justine Moritz. I believe he wants to take Mary to the hanging. A romantic. You know how it is, Percy. Sex and dare. <laughs> ah, there she is. My love. Mary, allow me to introduce Dr. Joseph Buchanan. As it happens, we've already met. How do you do again, Dr. Buchanan? That is the most mysterious cloud I've ever seen. See, a remote sunlight gleams, as though it were not a cloud at all, but a gateway to a distant world. What did you want to see me about, Dr. Buchanan? Miss Godwin, I know that you've been following the trial of Justine Moritz. You must help me try and stop her from hanging. Why come to me? Because you know that the girl is innocent. You know the truth. Well, that's what your book is about. What do you know of my book? I've only a few chapters of a story. Are you from a journal, sir? Worse. Maybe publisher. Yes, I believe the girl is innocent. But I don't know anything that would help her. Forgive me. I thought that you knew the truth. I thought that you could help me. 